All right, good morning, uh, Ray KD2 IDP. Uh, coming back to a project that we were going to start a little bit earlier in the year. We purchased this uh, Heath Kit SB200 back in uh, around March, and uh, I had purchased a couple other items that I was going to upgrade this amplifier with back in March as well, but I haven't had an opportunity to start pushing this project forward because I have settled down with a bunch of other projects also. So this has really just been sitting on the bench. We did buy a power supply board for it. That's brand new. Uh, we got that off of eBay. It's allegedly been tested and uh, we'll give it a whack. I think, uh, I think we'll be fine with that. It's nothing complicated to build a uh, power supply board. I also uh, purchased a uh, soft key interface to bring the 120 volt DC down to uh, about 7.5 volt so I could safely interface with the 857 Delta uh, that this is going to be paired up with. Uh, I'm hoping to get about 600 watts out of this thing. Maybe more, we'll see. Uh, I'm not looking at it too optimistically, but um, I would like to breathe some life into it. Uh, when we first purchased the equipment, uh, we did sta state that uh, I got it from a silent key, and I was going to try to find out his name. I, I still have not found out his name. I'm going to try to reach out to the uh, seller one more time. I don't want to hound the guy. Uh, to him, it probably doesn't mean much, but to me, it means a little bit more. Um, the faceplate on this, we still haven't really decided where, which direction we're going in with that. I'm having a difficult time finding out uh, where to get this silk screened. I see a lot of uh, overlays that I could put on this, uh, but uh, I would like to get this powder coated black the way that uh, I did the rest of the casing. I decided to go black on the powder coating. I sent it out locally, um, and they did a real good job on it. Uh, they thought we were going to have a little bit of a problem with the hinge. They thought they were going to have a little problem with the hinge, but uh, they really navigated themselves through that potential problem quite nicely. They did a good job on that. Uh, that's about it. So I'm going to turn some screws. I'm going to start pulling this thing apart. I'm going to put the electronics in there. Uh, I'm still going to hammer away uh, trying to find out whether or not I could have this silk screen. Uh, I might put the faceplate back on as is just till I figure out what I'm doing. But I'm a little anxious to get this thing up and running because uh, I hear some contacts out in the yonder and I would like to uh, be able to establish contact with them. Um, but I'm only running 100 watts right now, barefoot. Alright, and that is that. Until I get this thing put together and up and running, uh, I'm going to go clear. KD2 IBP. Till then, 73s.